it is Sherry Chapman here bringing you another video hey but this one is something new yes something new it is brown opera Oop. <laughs> damn but um yeah it is from Ulta my little goodie bag from Ulta so I'm just gonna show you all the stuff that I brought from Ulta like Saturday, Sunday, Friday, one of the days, whatever. Um, and half the stuff I did do this makeup look with. I know, kind of beginning, so you know, you know. Bear with me, okay? The motherfucker's just learning. Okay, so with all the stuff I brought, they gave me this free um, Dermacologica, I guess that's how you say it. I done messed it up a whole bunch of times. Professional Skin Treatment Kit. Um, free Ulta $24 value. It came with a uh, cleansing gel, smoothing cream, power firm, lotion, and recovery mask. So that is that. Um, and I heard that Soap and Glory was now at Ulta. <laughs> yes. Uh, you know your girl had to go to Ulta. Get me some soap and glory soap and glory but this one is the sugar crush this isn't like the normal one that everybody always get the uh, righteous butter a uh, body butter or the flake away uh soap scrub i wanted to get it but 10 15 dollars and it didn't smell that good to me like everybody else was saying so you know your girl had to get this one because i love how it smells it's just beautiful delicious the only thing i don't like is like the one I got from Bath and Body Works make me feel like I'm all nice and old and moisturized, you know. Get, make a sister feel smooth after getting out the shower. This one, you just put it on, rub it on, wash it off, and then, you know. It don't even smell like how it smells on the tube. It don't smell like that on my body, but the one from Bath and Body Works does. I use the Moonlight Path one. Um, oh, let me, I'll tell you the prices, or I'll just um, list them down below, okay? Um... And then I got this L'Oreal Infallible Pro Matte 16 Hour Wear um, Matte Finish Powder. Um, I basically use this for all a uh, bronzy contoured look. As you can see here, I did use it today. The only thing I could say is that it's a little bit red for my skin tone. I have golden yellow skin um it's just a little bit more red so if you guys know of any you know girl friendly um it's hard if I'm looking down I'm reading the, the um receipt in the receipt but um if y'all could recommend any drugstore high end whatever bronzes that's good for my shade and C45 from MAC let me know but I use this for now as a bronzer contour thing for my nose and you know my little area um I didn't use this yet, but I've heard a lot of good things about it. This is the Becca Ultimate Coverage Complexion Cream, Creme Cream, whatever. Um, I brought the shade Tobacco because I went on this website called Fine Nation that matches your skin tone to foundations. When you um, give them foundation that you have worn, I put um, MAC NC45 Studio Fix um, foundation and I put Revlon color stay in the number 400 caramel because those are the two that I normally use um, I've tried I can't find the Maybelline Pro Matte invisible one I'm trying to find my perfect shade I just can't find it um, but yeah it comes with a pump very nice and sleek um, this was $44 my husband was like you know you owe me for this right I'm like um, no my look should be enough but, um, yeah, so I brought that. Um, for some reason, I brought this. This is like a nice little cheap little um, eyeshadow palette. This is 03 Sunrise. I don't know if you can see that there. Sunrise. This is from Essence. Um, I will show you guys swatches. If you want to see that, let me know. Um, I did a little bit of that look with using this. I used this gold right here. I'll just give you a little cute, quick little swatch. That's the swatch right there. Very pigmented though. I must say it was like $2.29 or something like that. But um Yeah. There it goes right there. A little bit powdery, but what do you expect from like almost drugstore price? 
but there it goes. Um, I also brought this, the Maybelline Instant Age Rewind Erase Dark Circles. I got it in the shade Neutralizer. I tried the um, the medium one, but I didn't like it. Like I tried it a long time ago. I probably just didn't know how to use it. But I brought the Neutralizer one because I'm both cool and warm toned that I heard. So I got this to give it a try. I haven't used it yet. See, it's in the packet. Um, I brought this NYX and I already opened everything up just to give you swatches or whatever so you can look at it clearly. I brought the NYX High Voltage Lipstick. This is in the shade 09. 09. And the name of it is Dahlia. There it goes. I did swatch my lipsticks though for you guys to see. Um, this one right here. This one right here, the third one, that is Dahlia. And it is shiny, I will tell you that. I'm not a shiny, lip glossy looking girl. I'm more of a matte person, so I don't know about that. I might have to use a powder or something, because uh -uh, I really don't like lip gloss stuff. Because I like matte, it won't get stuck to your tooth or nothing like that. But, um, yeah. Anyway, I was looking all over the store for this shit. I mean, this um lipstick. Sorry, my eyes is watering. Um... And in the NYX section, it was nowhere to be found. Everything's like picked over. I was like, well, goddamn. So mostly all the shades I wanted wasn't there anyway. But um, I did find it at the counter in a little bucket. I was like, oh, y'all trying to hold out on a sissy. I don't want me to buy you the something. But anyway, this is the NYX Matte Lipstick. NYX Matte Lipstick. And this is in the shade. I don't know if you guys can see that, but there you go. Uh, Mason. And everybody is saying it's comparable to Mac Stone. I don't know. I don't own any Mac stuff anymore. I used to, but not anymore. But this is the shade here. So it's like a matte brown beige grayish. Let's just say grayish, okay? Grayish right there. And it is matte. So. I don't know. Um, and I brought another NYX matte lipstick. Well, lip cream, soft matte lip cream. And this is in the shade Transylvania, number 21. Can you guys see that? Okay, Transylvania. Um, this is it right here. This first one. And I would say it is matte. It's not all the way matte. Like, it's not matte matte. It's probably like semi, demi, whatever matte. But it reminds me of Dahlia from the Voltage collection. Uh, also got the NYX Liquid Suede. I had a whole bunch that I wanted to get, but this was the only one that they had. And then they had some other ugly colors that would not go good with my skin tone. And I brought this one in the shade Tea and Cookies, number 09. And this is it right here. Nice little pinky, I wouldn't say mauve I would just say pinky color, cotton candy on my, would you say this is cotton candy? It's cotton candy, he don't know. Okay. This is another NYX matte lip cream. Yes, matte. I am a matte girl. I like matte. Uh, this is number 20, Copenhagen. Hey, you say it. Yep. Sorry, I want their room separated. Nope. Why? This is the shade right here. Nice little burgundy deep red. Well, I would say kind of berry wine. Berry wine. Wine berry. We'll put them together. Make up a name, you know. But this is the shade right here. Um, if you want to see live list watches, just let me know. And I have heard that uh, Makeup Revolution was coming to YouTube, um, not YouTube, but was coming to Ulta. So I went on their website and I checked out a few of their things. Um, and I seen some stuff that I did like. So I went to Ulta and I was like, well, let me go and see what it's all about. You know, they, it's, it's very affordable stuff. Like, I probably didn't wind up paying more than $5.99, $6, $7 on something. But this is the first thing I brought. I had a whole bunch of lip matte lip lacquers that I wanted to buy from them. But they only had this one and some other new colors that, once again, will make me look like I've been eating donuts all day. But this is it. This is 
the Makeup Revolution Salvation Velvet Lip Lacquer. And I love, 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 mwah, love it. Like, for real, for real. Like, $5, you can't beat it. Freaking gorge. I have it on my lips right now. Mwah. But, yeah. I have it on my lips right now. I did pair it with a liner. It's not no name brand liner. It's like Mika K or NK's um, Dark Purple, I believe. Whatever. Just put a dark purple or a dark maroon berry looking liner on your lips. Put this on your lips. Wham, bam. Thank you, ma'am. Here you go. But, um... This is it right here. This is what it looks like. Cute little sleek packaging. Reminds me almost of the MAC lip glasses. But, um, oh, I didn't swatch it on my hand because, nigga, I got it on my lips. I mean, I got it on my lips. My bad. Um, but I'll just swatch it right quick, right quick. And there you go right there. Oh, this is such weird positioning, like. Who does, like, who does this? <laughs> Look, but this is the shade right here. And it does dry to a matte finish. Mwah, nothing. So, um, I love it. We'll be getting me some more of those. Um, as far as the NYX soft matte lip creams, I'm, I'm not really feeling them. I don't think I will be. Like, the only one I do like is, um, Copenhagen. So, I don't think I'll be sticking to that line. I'm going to try the lipstick tomorrow and the liquid suede to see if they like matte matte like I like matte. Like non-transfer matte. But, yeah. But, um, I had brought another one. This is Paraguay. Par Paraguay. Gooey. Gu Gu yeah. Okay, I will chop this name all to pieces. But this is the name right here. Number 18, okay. Number 18, it's like a nice pinky berry color. And this is the shade right here. And I love me some pink right there. Second one right there. So those are all my lip products. And my last two products is again from NYX. I was just on a NYX spree. I was like, give me some of that NYX, 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 NYX. Oh, I should make a song. Give me some of that NYX, 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 NYX. Give me some of that NYX, NYX, NYX. Anyway, um... I brought this. It was like two for five. I got another one. No, buy one, get one half off. They had a lot of sales this today. I mean, this time. Like, buy one, get one half off. Buy two, get one free. Um, yeah. So, I got this one. And I also, I think I got a, a silver one or a gold one. This, But this is the pure white one. It is a NYX slide on glide on stay on waterproof extreme shine eyeliner it says this eyeliner i'm so sorry this eyeliner is so good the name had to be this long no it didn't you could have just said glide on eyeliner but i have that underneath on my waterline try to give it like a you know open eye doll eye effect you know but like i said I'm learning, so learn with me. Um, but yeah, I put it in my waterline a little bit. It's okay. It's okay. You know. It's okay. Anyway, my last product. Nope, sorry, not last. Mm. That's what happens when you go shopping for the first time buying makeup. You just do do do. Give me that. Give me that. Give me that. Thank you. Um, NYX NYX brow gel in the color espresso just a deep brown they said this is almost comparable to the um anastasia beverly hills dip brow pomade in the shade is it dark chocolate or ebony dark chocolate or ebony one of the two but yeah it's comparable to that um the only thing i would have to say about it is that i wish it came in like a container but then i don't because this you could just squeeze a little bit on your hand or a palette of some sort and then apply it to your eyebrows but um I don't know I haven't tried it yet as you can see it is still in the mother freaking box so when I try it I will let you know I'll do an eyebrow tutorial if you want to know with this one I had I did what did I use the L'Oreal gel eyeliner 
the um the one in dark brown um this is what i use to do my eyebrows if you want to see an eyebrow tutorial hit the link the like button or comment down below yeah let me see that um last two products i promise i promise um is another makeup revolution product i should have just kept all the name brands together and just been like nyx 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 makeup revolution but um i keep looking down <laughs> sorry but um this is another makeup revolution product this is the matte blush this is in the shade new rules and i have this on a little bit on my apples on my cheeks so i don't know if you could really tell i didn't put that much because I, this okay this, mm, this is very very pigmented guys i only had to dip it in once like doop, and then dab it on but it's very pigmented here's the color right here i don't i need to find a non-weird spot to put this but there it is right there matte um and the last thing that i brought period end of this video is the makeup revolution um ultra blush palette and this is in the color hot spice if you can see that hot spice so yeah um they have shimmers they have mattes and they have a uh, baked so if you want to see any swatches of my blushes that i have or my highlights that i have um just let me know i don't want to blind you guys but this is what it looks like here we got some um like nice little brownie peachy colors you have some pinky colors mauvey pinky colors then you have some lighter pinker pro um products blushes and then you have a um mauvey pink blush and you have a nice little i wouldn't say I would say a peachy silver, peachy silver blush. But you could just use these as highlighters, um, which I know I probably will because um, no one is to say that just because it's a blush, you need to use it as a blush. Makeup is universal. You could use it as anything. But overall, I had spent $171 up in Ulta. Um, and this is all that I got. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed my video. If you had any questions, comments, requests down below is the comment boxes. You could just hit it, type it up, hit send, and I will be on my way to replying and making another video for you. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed my video. There is more to come. Maybe some makeup looks, maybe some um hair tutorials because I got this little messed up looking bun up here. I don't know what the hell it is but I just stuck it up there and had to pick up my daughter from the bus. Yeah. Rambling. Don't do that. But um, yeah, this is all the stuff I brought and it's my first makeup haul so I hope you guys did enjoy and let's get this thing to a thousand likes, a hundred likes. Hell, let's get it to fifty likes, okay? Hit subscribe, hit thumbs up, and hit comment and type it up and Let's just get my channel rolling, okay? I'm doing this guys for you. Um, and I 